hello everyone it's your favorite queen android 18 here and today we're going to be playing some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links and I'm going to be opening some packs today so I'm just going to check it's recording yes it is and I'm going to be opening them as Dark Signer version of Carly Carmine she is the um one of the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's waifus along with Aki just showing them off a little bit, so yeah, I'm gonna be um Kali. So, Jack. So let's open some packs because, as you can see, I've maxed out my gems and my gift box is like full of gems. So, I'm probably gonna make a Dragon Ball video as my next video after this, but I thought, why not just um <laughs> open some packs because I've got way too many gems, which is not very common in this game. So. Let's have a little look at the boxes. So it looks pretty interesting so far. So there's a new there's new revenge red monsters, which are zombies, I believe. Yeah. So that's interesting. Oh, pyramid turtles out. That's a cool card. Oops, I've got some gas. I think I've been having some of that android fueled energy drink. <laughs> Oops, but yeah, I'm recording this in the usual unprofessional dual link style but hope you guys like it i actually haven't planned out what pack i want to open so i'm just having a little look see this pack looks cool because it's got mermails in it and nightmare penguin he's cute oh no my dragon ball legends notifications because the last pack i opened i believe was blazing rose because black rose dragon was in it and that's like one of my favorite synchros but yeah my phone's being a little slow today Red Eyes Baby Dragon. I haven't got him yet. I think, um... Oh, I want to get Chevalier de Fleur. Because that's one of um, Sherry's monsters in 5Ds. Once during each of your turns when your opponent activates a spell or trap card, you can negate the activation and destroy that card. That's a really good rare. So let's open some of these and see how we get on. So I'm going to open 10 packs of um, Blazing Rose first. So you get the cute little Karibo. Shout out to Little Karibo, the one who does Yu Gi Oh! Abridged. He's amazing, check him out. He's got loads of subs, but just watch him, he's funny as hell. I mean, HFIL. But yeah, nothing interesting so far. I'm just, um, you know, opening these packs. Oh, that's a cool little um, fusion monster. No, Facebook, shut up. Guard Dragon, Soul Absorption. Hey, we saw that in the last episode. A synchro monster magical android that's cool i'm skipping the um slow animations like the ones that aren't important we can show that it's a little karibo there karibo so cute but yeah we haven't got any luck so far with any super res or ultra res so let's just keep going zone that's a weird card so i'm kind of skipping through this a lot because we're going to be opening quite a few packs i think so we've got another animation there's Fleur synchron that's what Sherry uses to make Fleur de Chevalier. So I think I'm just going to keep opening this for now. Hmm, maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not really sure what I want. Oh, Miracle Fertilizer. I want that card because it's a plant support card. So let's just keep opening Blazing Rose for now. Share the Pain. That's an interesting card. As usual, I'm so professional with this kind of style of video. Copy plant's a cool card. I use that in my plant deck. There's Fleur de Chevalier. Oh no, Chevalier de Fleur. Sorry, my bad. I was saying it like the opposite way around for some reason. Oh, we had a little sparkle there. So let's see what we get. Subterra Behemoth Ultra Mephus. We had triple Karibo there. Oh, it's a sparkly. We get Carly and her dark sign eyes. I like Green Phantom King. He's cool. Nice normal monster. Oh, Black Metal Dragon. That's a cool card. And again, we get the BAM. What have we got? Miracle Fertilizer. We got it, guys. Yay. That's awesome. We're getting really lucky with these. I seem a little low energy, I guess, at the moment. Oh, White Rose Dragon, that's really cool. Yeah, it's just because um, it's a little late here, but it's 
I just wanted to record some opening, some pack openings. If I can talk properly, this would be good. Another cool animation. Let's see what we get. Keeper of the Shrine. That's a really good card too for Dragon decks. That's really awesome. Duel Links looks so cool. With all these sparkly stuff. So I think we'll go away from Blazing Rose because we've pretty much got what, we want, what I wanted already. I'm very easy to please in Duel Links. I just like what I like and then I don't really care about other stuff. Amulet Dragon. I don't have that card. That's one of the Dark Magician fusion cards with Eye of Tamias. So that's really cool. Make sure to hit the like button if you're enjoying it so far. I always try and remind you guys because it really does help the videos grow and stuff. Also hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and hit the bell. So YouTube pretty much will tell you whenever I upload a video because that's very helpful for the channel too. But yeah, I'll stop um, making plugs and I'll actually try and pull... Um, Amulet Dragon, because I love Dark Magician. I also I pulled all the Ultra Rares, that's why I haven't opened the rest of this setup. But it's worth opening at least 10 packs to see if we can get the um, Eye of Tomias and um, Amulet Dragon. I think, yeah, the new um, Magnet Warriors are in this set, and they won the World Championships, I believe. It's either that or Six Samurais, I can't remember. The Triomids came out in this set too. So it's very jam-packed with cool cards. Red Eyes, Black Sword, Dragon Sword's really cool. Are we going to get the thing we want? Yeah, um, there's no cooking slash pieing going on right now, so there's not going to be any noise of Krillin and Bulma downstairs like there was the other day. And hopefully the house doesn't catch on fire, so there should be no fire alarm. Ooh, that was a really cool little sparkling animation. Ooh, the Claw of Hemos and Trimid Cruiser. That's a field spell, that's cool. Basically, if you're not aware, in this game, you normally get sparkly stuff when you're going to pull like a super ultra rare, which are normally the more powerful cards in the set and the ones you want to get. So, basically, if it's sparkly, it's really good. But just normal packs can have helpful cards too. Like, a lot of the commons and rares are useful too. Like, Tyrant Ring's a decent card, for example, which we just got. Tyrant Burst Dragon. Celestial Sword Yatos, that's really cool. Hopefully we can get Guardian Yatos as well. The thing is with Duel Links, if you buy the whole box, you're guaranteed to get everything in the box. So it's more of a gamble to see if you can get what you want without spending as many gems. That's kind of where the gamble comes in, but I've got so many gems, it doesn't really matter at this point. But it's really fun to open them. We could get Prismatic Res too. So that's the Eye of Tamias, which we wanted. It's the card which you use to fuse Dark Magician to make the amulet dragon that we're looking for. So that's really cool. Maron's asleep by the way because it's late. Oh, sparkly. Let's see if Carly's kawaii eyes will get us what we want. So we've got the cute block dragon. That's interesting. Rapid fire pack round. Let's go. If it ain't shiny, We'll just keep going. That's a cool normal monster. I like that one. Another Eye of Tamias. That's good. Yeah, in Yu-Gi-Oh! you can run up to three of every card. So as long as you've got three of everything, then you're all good to go. In Duel Links, if you get any spares of cards, like more than three of a certain card, which isn't prismatic, you can convert them into coins of gold to buy more cards. So that's pretty cool. Guardian Dread Scythe's a cool card. Raphael summons that um, after Iatos is destroyed in the anime. Edgy Dread Scythe. I guess we can open 10 more packs and then see if we can get it. And if not, we'll go to another pack. I don't want to spend all the gems today. I'll just open a few more packs and then I can make some more opening videos in the future. Yay, we got the dragon we wanted. Amulet Dragon. It's the fusion between Eye of Tamias and Dark Magician. So he gains 100 attack points for every spell card in the graveyard. And um, if it's destroyed, you can target a spell card in your graveyard and special summon it. So that's really awesome. You can also bring back Dark Magician Girl with that too. So that's really good. Okay, this is already awesome. We got what we wanted. Goddess Bow, that's a cute one. 
I think the little sparkles there, we got two rares instead of one, so that's pretty good. I don't know everything about Duel Links, but I know most of the things. So let's just keep opening. God, I suppose, cool. Oh, we got some sparkles. What did we get? Tyrant Burst Dragon. That's interesting. I think you have to fuse, like, Tyrant Ring with Blue Eyes to do that or something. Oh, a Synchro Monster. Thought Ruler Archfiend. That's really good. I believe Saya or Slash Divine uses that in the anime. Divine is cool. Well, he's a real douchebag in the anime, but, um... Aki likes him for a while. He tortures slash kills kids. I also apologize, my throat's making funny noises because I've been drinking energy drinks. But yeah, um, I'm not sure where Neos is. What set Neos is in? Uh, I'm not sure. I think we'll open a few more packs and then we'll just um, see what we get from there. This video is really chill today. I like making these more chill videos. It's just relaxing. And I hope you guys like the um, different content too. I will make some normal content soon, but I really love Dual Links. I think I want to pull a Necro Fusion because that's a really good card for summoning monsters. You basically use monsters in your graveyard to make fusion monsters, which is really helpful. So let's try and pull that card. That is a creepy artwork. Magio Sheldon. <laughs> That's just a really weird one. Let me know how your day's going in the comments. I love it when you guys comment. I read most of them. Well, I read like them all when you post them when I first release a video and then I come back and read them later. Normally throughout the day when I'm like on my break or something. Getting some sick samurais and desk bots. Desk bots are one of my friend's favourite archetypes. So shout out to my friend Chaos Ace. Slash Chaos Force, depending on what game he's playing. Miss Polymerization's interesting. Oh, the sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Let's see what we get. Herald of the Abyss. That's interesting. Scrap Goblin. And finally, we're going to get Jirak Hera. Hmm, should we open up some more packs? Because it's really fun. Yeah, we'll open up some more packs. I think, um, once we get Necrofusion, we should probably end the video. But, um, I guess I could show off some, like, Kali stuff, maybe. Yay, we got the cute Quillbot Hedgehog. That's awesome. One of my favourite monsters from the 5Ds era. It summons itself back from the graveyard so you can sync with someone with it. Disc what two. That's cool. I apologize if you guys don't let me like going through the packs so fast. It's just you see the commons a lot in the sets and yeah. If you're interested you can pause them the, the video and stuff. And also, pretty much if you play the game you'll see them anyway, so I don't know. I'm just being like awkward. Will this be the last 10 packs? We'll have to find out and see. Okay, Sparkles, let's see what we get. Oh no, the six style dual wield. I've been having a little issues like making the audio line up with my talking audio because I don't have professional equipment. I'm just recording on my phone. So hopefully um, I've lined this up properly in editing. We'll just have to see. Okay, so hopefully we get the card we want. Scrap Factory. That is really cool, because that's for synchros and stuff. And for scrap decks, that's fun. Despot 9. That's really fun. Jirak Giganoto. That's pretty cool. I like dinosaurs. Where's our Necrofusion? I'm getting impatient now. Quick Draw Synchron. That is a really cool card I didn't have and I needed it for my um, Junk Warrior deck slash Stardust Dragon, so that's really awesome. Mobius the Frost Monarch. That's a really good pull. Oh my gosh, this is pretty darn awesome. Let's buy one pack and see what we get because I'm being like changing it up. Two Synchros, that's pretty cool. Should I keep opening one packs until we get Necrofusion? 
That's just awkward. I don't know why I'm doing it, but I am. So let's go for it. I'll keep buying one pack until we get to um, 20 packs, because then it'll be even. Man, opening, I'm opening a load of packs today. But you'll see why, because I'll open all my gifts in my gem box and have like another 2,000 gems. So, that'll be pretty funny. But yeah, we're going to get Necrofusion at some point, because we are nearly bought the box out. So, we'll just keep opening until we get them, I guess. I'm sucking the mystery out of this and just hacking my way to the cards I want. Super Big Void Stealth Union's a cool one. Yeah, make sure to like the video if you're enjoying it, because I don't know what else to say. Yay, we got Necrofusion. My friend also plays that in real life. We finally got the card we wanted, which is awesome. Can we pull two in the same pack? Ten packs, that's the question. Yay, we pulled them both. <laughs> I think I cursed that and made it so it gave me to both Necrofusions. It's a really good card. Okay, that was awesome. I'm going to open these gifts and you'll just see how many more gems I've got. So let's have a look. Okay, so we're back up to 6,000 gems. So we had about 1,000 gems in our gift box. So that was absolutely awesome. I hope you enjoyed this, well, not exactly quick, but pack opening video for Dual Links. Carly gave us all the luck we needed. I love you, Carly. You're amazing. They recently released the event so you can unlock Carly. I'm just going to show you the little page for the event. She has a amazing, like, victory demon face. It's the nice messed up face in Yu-Gi-Oh, but she's awesome. She's the best waifu with Akiza and 5Ds. And she's awesome. But anyway... I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit the like button, subscribe and everything, and I hope you have a lovely day. Anyway, I'll stop randomly just rambling because I don't know what else to say. But anyway, I hope you have a lovely day. And also, don't forget everyone, subscribe to me because I'm definitely 18.